Hey guys, James Wilson Taylor here for Roxanne. We are at When We Were Young Festival 2022, the ready set are on the lineup. Jordan joins me now. How are you, man? I am well. How are you? Not too bad, not too bad. Yep. First things first, let's start with the obvious. Not the best start to the weekend for all of us. Oh, no. I feel disappointed <laughs> for everyone yesterday, but yeah. it's got to feel pretty good to finally be here, especially with yeah. this lineup, man. Yeah, no, it's, it's crazy. It's kind of like yesterday was so disappointing because it's been a thing that's just been like in my head for over a year now. Oh, and it was just to show up and be setting up and then just be like, oh, never mind, but it's awesome to be here now. I'm glad it yeah glad it worked out yeah absolutely how did you approach kind of preparing this live show for this well because i've chatted to a few bands who've just been like we want to play bangers we want to like really really kind of hone a set kind of specifically yeah. for this festival how do you approach it i pretty much just that thing I, awesome. I was just thinking like what are the you know like the songs i know people know what are like the old ones that like you know like the you know 2010 era songs like just kind of trying to pick that rather than be like oh i'm gonna do some some new stuff i'd yeah. rather just make everyone have fun and you know yeah be into it hey it's a good idea it's an exciting way to do it i want to talk a little bit i guess actually about the ready set in general because it felt like for a minute i know you're, you're a busy guy you do loads of other projects but it feels like now over the last kind of few months or so maybe the last year it's been bringing that name back a little bit for your project i guess why now yeah. why did you decide that was kind of the right time again honestly this kind of was a big part of it i think oh, really? we got, i got this uh i got offered to do this festival a long time ago and I was like oh yeah cool definitely it sounds fun I didn't know what the lineup was or anything I was like sure and then I saw the, the flyer and I was like oh sick yeah, yeah. but um, you know we booked this and then I just did like a couple little headline shows and I was like oh this is very fun I have so many like new songs that I've made and I'm just like you know why not just like make some new stuff and have some fun because I've kind of always just like come and gone and like mm. disappear for a while and come back but I don't know. It just seems like the fun thing to do right now. Yeah, nice to yeah. embrace the moment for sure, for sure. For sure. For sure. In terms of that new music, I obviously had that collab with American Teeth, which mm -hmm. was very, very cool. Tell me a little bit about working with them and, and how that track in particular kind of came together for you. That one, um, me and Elijah are super good friends. I just saw him two minutes ago. But, nice. Uh, it's, it was kind of just the thing. We were just working on some stuff together. I don't know. I think it was for his project originally. And then I was like, we should probably just put this out together and just made a weird hyper pop, pop punk thing or pop, pop punk thing. <laughs> Pop pump. Yeah, that's yeah, it's a good. It's a hard phrase to get you with, yeah, yeah. I get that. Um, tell me about what else is kind of in the locker then. Have you been working on much more ready set stuff? Again, I know you're so yeah. busy with loads of other stuff as well. Yeah, but yeah. How much I, is coming together? It's it's been like kind of a slow process. It's sort of a thing where so much of my time is spent doing like production for like other artists and things like that. Yeah. So I'm like trying to fit in days to like finish the stuff. But there's a handful of things, and uh, I'm excited about it. It's just kind of just making whatever I think is cool and not putting too much pressure on it just have fun yeah exciting to see what comes next with that man it really really is uh, I'm glad you mentioned kind of writing for other projects because of course that, that incredible moment with 17 kind of oh, recently yeah. man that's that's got to be so satisfying yeah. to not only work with an artist that's as huge as that but yeah. that's then I guess stretch yourself out in a, a kind of slightly different direction I know you've always done poppier stuff but mm -hmm. that's like such a different world yeah. to the one you would have as a performer got to be yeah. really exciting to work on that it's, it's amazing all like it's kind of become a thing where because of that like a lot more K-pop stuff kind of like you know ends up being stuff that I'm like working on sort of now and then and it's so exciting because that stuff is so so fun to make because you can really just like be as you know creative as you want and it still is just going to be like a crazy big pop thing and it's like to see it actually like live and stuff is the craziest thing ever it's so fun man so so cool I'm going to let you go and enjoy this massive day and this massive massive lineup but before I do one question I gotta ask absolutely everybody with that lineup that's out there today I'm sure a lot of friends of yours on there as well yeah. if you had to collab with anyone on there who's the dream collab out of the people Ooh, on this lineup today that's tough um in my head, it doesn't it doesn't make any sense, but I personally am very very excited about AFI. Yes. That would be sick. I know it doesn't make any sense for a collab, but I'm just gonna go with that because I love AFI. Best ones don't make any sense, though, <laughs> I know, man. I know, that's you're when right, it you're comes. Right. That's when you hit that sweet spot, man. So you I, and Davey. I, I stand by that. Yeah, AFI. Right, shout yeah. out, Davey. Have it, yes, um, dude. Really really nice to see you. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks, right? man. Thanks Good for having me. Good to see you. The ready set, everybody.